I will now describe in greater detail the specific structures which can be visualized on this ultrasound video clip of the pregnant cow. At this stage, the ultrasound probe has been inserted via the rectum into the cow, and we will perform a methodical ultrasound examination of the entire reproductive tract. This includes the cervix, the uterus, and both ovaries. Currently, we are viewing the urinary bladder of the cow. This should not be confused for the presence of a pregnancy or fluid-filled uterine horns. What we can see at the very top of the screen is the cervical region. This is a tubular structure which is soft tissue and hence the gray appearance on the ultrasound image. To confirm pregnancy in this cow, we would ideally like to visualize four specific features. That would include a corpus luteum on the ovary, the presence of fetal fluids within the uterus, the presence of fetal membranes, and finally the fetus itself. What we are now seeing is that the ultrasound probe is being pushed further cranially or towards the head end of the cow. We are looking to identify the uterus and hopefully in this cow, if she is pregnant, we will see the presence of tubular structures filled with anechoic or black fluid, and that's them just there. As we can see, they are quite prominent, and this gives us an idea that this cow is pregnant due to the presence of fluid within the uterus, and this fluid is anechoic or black without the indication of particulate matter. We will now evaluate the ovary on this side. It's the structure on the screen just now. It's a spherical structure, and we can see the presence of several follicles, the black fluid-filled objects on the screen. We will then continue back down the horn and up the other side of the uterus, the other uterine horn. At this stage, the other ovary comes into view with the presence of a corpus luteum, which is a gray, homogeneous, smooth appearing structure on the screen just now. We will then continue back down towards the bladder, which is now on the screen, and back up to evaluate the pregnancy. We can now further evaluate the pregnancy, and now we see the fetus, surrounded by the amniotic membrane, there's the presence of a heartbeat, and the size of this indicates that it is 37 days. We get one last glimpse of the corpus luteum as we come out.